I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. A new study finds that dogs are capable of lying, which we all should have known already. I mean, you give him treats, then he goes to someone else in the house and begs for treats again, as if he never got any from you. President Trump's new travel ban took effect yesterday, so if you were planning on escaping America, too late. A woman on a flight from China to Australia awoke mid-flight after her battery-operated headphones exploded, caught fire, and began to melt. Ironically, at the time, she'd been listening to Billy Joel's We Didn't Start the Fire. An Oregon man led police on a high-speed chase this week in a stolen street sweeper truck. <laughs> What's high speed in a street sweeper? What, seven, eight miles an hour? <laughs> uh, he was trying to make a clean getaway. <laughs> yeah, I'm so funny. Rescue workers had to remove part of a wall to pull a naked man out of a sandwich shop where he spent the night trapped inside a narrow passage. A construction crew arriving at a job site in Napa, California heard faint calls for help coming from the closed shop. It appears the man fell into the shaft from the roof of the building where he said he was looking for a wishing well. Now, As to why he was naked, no explanation. I can only assume he thinks wishing wells work better if you're in your birthday suit. Now, Come to think of it, where was he keeping the change he was going to throw into the well? Scientists estimate that the world's spider population eats 400 to 800 million tons of bugs every year. So, yeah, you're ugly and scary, but thank you, you eight-legged freaks! Yahoo! CEO Marissa Mayer will get $23 million in severance pay on her way out of the company. I'm, uh, I'm leaving a copy of this on the boss's desk, with that $23 million in severance highlighted in bright yellow. Syria's civil war hit the six-year mark on Wednesday. Um, congratulations? Ben Affleck revealed he recently checked into rehab and underwent treatment for alcohol addiction. Well, you know, if a super-powered alien from outer space started yelling out your mother's name, you'd probably start drinking too. Residents of Ocala, Florida have been warned to be on the lookout for an escaped pet – a cobra. So as you prepare for the arrival of spring, you might not want to take for granted that that garden hose is actually a garden hose. A new study finds that only one in ten kids in Oklahoma City owns a watch, and just one in five are able to tell time by reading the face of a watch or clock. <laughs> Come on, kids! All right, all right. When Mickey's little hand is on the four and his big hand is on the one, it's five past four. Okay, gee, you know, all right, now, now that I say that out loud, it does sound confusing. On Saturday, a 70-pound popcorn ball was stolen from a display spot outside a popcorn shop in Ohio. The story has a happy ending, though. Someone anonymously returned the popcorn ball to the store late Tuesday or early Wednesday. The stolen popcorn ball was returned intact. They probably returned it after realizing they'd just stolen a 70-pound popcorn ball, which has a total street value of nothing. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe if you want to see more and click that little bell next to the subscribe button to be notified when I post new videos. This episode is made possible in part by my Patreon supporters. For DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com, I'm Darren Marlar.